good morning children we already completed polynomials the new chapter you are going to start today that is heron's formula as you know that some of the portions already deleted from the cbse uh, syllabus you know that very well it is published already in the cbse curriculum cbse nick.in you can check for that whichever portions deleted deleted chapter wise i will inform you and uh, now we are going to start new chapter that is heron's formula Heron's formula is used for finding area of the triangle only. Area of the triangle, you have used which formula? Half into base into the triangle. Normal formula, it is half into base into height. That means you should know the base as well as the perpendicular distance, right? That is the height. So, in case it is not given, that is the B and H is not given, in terms of the three sides, we have to find the area means we are having one more formula that is called the Heron's formula. Heron only suggested this formula, so his name is given to this formula only. So, Heron's formula means area of the triangle only we are going to calculate. So, Heron's formula means it is equal to Heron's formula or for finding area of the triangle only equal to s into root of s into s minus a s minus b into s minus c where a b c means the three sides three sides of the triangle right and s means a plus b plus c by 2 that is semi perimeter a plus b plus c means the perimeter itself divided by 2 so this is the formula only so area of the triangle can be calculated based on the three sides here what happens base is given and perpendicular height is given now what is the difference here some of you know this formula also because we have already seen this formula for finding the area of the triangle uh, for in the olympiad questions and all but here is it is included in this uh, ninth class as a chapter only so i am suggesting the formula once again in terms of the three sides of the triangle heron suggested this formula so area of the triangle means root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c all these terms are in root only right now how we can calculate s s means sum of this all the three sides by 2 so it is also called as a semi perimeter right it is also called a semi perimeter so once again Heron's formula what should write for Heron's formula if a b c denote the length of the sides of a triangle a b c a b c denote the length of sides of the triangle a b c then area of the triangle a b c equal to root of s into s minus a s minus b s minus c where s equal to a plus b plus c by 2 is the semi perimeter of triangle a b c this uh, Heron's formula is true for whether it is equilateral triangle whether it is a right angled triangle but uh, the question is that they should give the length of three sides then only we can use this formula since the derivation is not required in your syllabus so we have to do problems based on that one so direct formula we have to learn learn the formula and do the problems only now problems find the area of the triangle whose sides are 13 centimeter 14 centimeter and 15 centimeter meaning is what if a triangle is given so all the three sides length is given a b c 13 14 15 like that any order you can take so a b c length is given so we have marked like that that means the three sides are given here right so three sides are given because we learned the formula half base into height means any base means corresponding height should be given that is not given in this question so what is the solution or the steps we will see now so solution i should write so let us take what is a b c here so a equal to 13 b equal to 15 c is equal sorry c equal to 15 centimeter 
okay i'll write like this a equal to 13 b equal to 15 so c equal to 15 so 14 so here also one correction is there that means if you have used a b that letter is used so usually you should denote this side as c right whichever letter is not used b c is the so i can use here as a right now a a c is the so which letter is not used the so b now any order we can give the names suppose i am taking this as a 13 next is 14 and c equal to 15 right so understood how to give the names a b is used c is the required remaining one it will be used here b c so a will be added here so a equal to 13 and b equal to 14 we got now we will take down like this a equal to 13 centimeter b equal to 14 centimeter c equal to 15 centimeter any order you can give nothing to worry about that one still we have learned some points means that is best only so that is why i suggested this way okay now what is the next step as you know the formula so semi perimeter to be calculated that is s a plus b plus c by 2 only right a plus b plus c by 2 that is a formula so 13 plus 14 plus 15 by 2 if you add what you will get a 3 plus 4 7 7 plus 5 12 balance 1 so 42 by 2 it is equal to 21 centimeter right so we got the semi perimeter now what is the formula Heron's formula by Heron's formula area of the triangle ABC equal to root of everything is inside the root only s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c so all the terms you must be very careful it is under the root only now we'll substitute the values root of what is s 21 bracket starts 21 minus 13 a we have taken 13 if once you name that one according to that only we have to substitute otherwise it is wrong only so 21 minus b b is 14 now 21 minus 15 right now simplify so what is in the bracket uh, root under the root what will get a 21 into 21 minus 13 what is answer 8 next 21 minus 14 7 into 21 minus 15 it is 6 so, uh, directly you can find the product and take the square root but the better way is that we will factorize the things here that is 3 into 7 2 into 2 into 2 into 7 into 2 into 3 now you see how many times uh, 3 is there here 1 and the last one so out of 2 we can take 1 similarly how many 7s 2 7 is there so we'll take out 1 2 pair you can see here from 1 pair of 2 you can take 1 2 again the second pair is there so one more 2 so what is that one 21 into 4 equal to 84 centimeter square see it is area only it is area only 81 84 centimeter square i repeat once again a equal to 13 b equal to 14 c equal to 15 i just suggested one method there is no compulsory to the write in that way any order you can give 13 14 15 after writing 13 14 15 what is the second step we should write s s means a semi perimeter a plus b plus c by 2 so substitute that one 13 plus 14 plus 15 by 2 that is equal to 21 centimeter now what is the next step by Heron's formula area of the triangle abc equal to root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c equal to root of 21 into 21 minus 13 into 21 minus 14 into 21 minus 15 simplify and 21 into 8 into 7 into 6 under the root you will get here you can take out the product and do the uh, take out the square root also but otherwise it is easy that 27 can be refactorized 3 into 7 
8 to uh, 2 into 2 into 2 7 7 only 6 2 into 3 you take out the pairs so 3 you can see in pairs 7 also in pair only but 2 is 2 pairs are there so we have to write it 2 times so take out the product you will get 84 centimeter square is the answer for this area of the triangle an isosceles triangle has perimeter 30 centimeter and each of equal side is 12 centimeter so what is given in the question if suppose it is a triangle abc only uh, then equal side is 12 centimeter right so we are marking ab as a and ab and ac are equal sides so now we will, let us take the third side bc that is equal to x right so what i can write here uh, solution the first step is uh, naming the whatever the sides is there so what is given in there a equal to b equal to 12 centimeter this time i am not given as a name based on a b c right so directly i had given that is also correct only so there i suggested one method that's only a equal to b equal to 12 centimeter now b c let us take c equal to x centimeter now what is given in the question perimeter equal to 30 centimeter that also i will write here perimeter equal to 30 centimeter right now what is the meaning of perimeter sum of all the three sides so a plus b plus c equal to 30 centimeter right now substitute the value a as a 12 b also 12 c is x so 24 plus x equal to 30 this implies what is x 30 minus 24 equal to 6 6 centimeter is the third side now we got the first two sides and now the third side that means three sides we got now the question is the area of the triangle only so which formula we can apply Heron's formula because all the three sides we got now so we should write by Heron's formula area of the triangle abc name is given so i am writing name area of the triangle abc equal to root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c right now we can come back to the substitution part it is equal to uh, what is s now s uh, we have not calculated so we should calculate s also here so i'll write here already perimeter is given so directly we can write a semi perimeter only s so s equal to a plus b plus c by 2 so it is 30 by 2 equal to 15 right so we have calculated only that also because it's a directly given perimeter as a 30 so what is the semi perimeter semi perimeter equal to half of the value that is 15 centimeter now we can substitute the values so root of 15 into bracket 15 minus 12 right because a we have taken 12 and 15 minus 12 one more time because b is also 12 for us what is c 15 minus 6 extend the root huh? now inside the root or under the root we can write 15 into 3 into 3 into 9 now last time itself i told if it is in a pairs we can take out so 3 repeated 2 times so i can write 1 3 outside now root 9 means what i can write 3 again first this pair only so 1 3 we got 9 one more 3 we got now root 15 i cannot do anything so i am writing in root 15 got now so what is the answer now 9 root 15 centimeter square got 9 root 15 centimeter square only so this is the answer for area of the triangle so here i repeat the question in uh, an isosceles triangle has a perimeter 30 centimeter equal sides are 12 centimeter for each so find the area of the triangle so perimeter is given from that we can calculate semi perimeter that is half of the value it is equal to 15 now equal sides is given a equal to b equal to 12 from this using the perimeter idea that is a plus b plus c 30 substitute 12 for a and b and third side we can calculate what is the third side third side x is equal to 6 centimeter now you got all the three sides 
again formula only so we have written the heron's formula here root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c substitute the values root of 15 into 15 minus 12 into 15 minus 12 into 15 minus 6 simplify in the root you will get 15 into 3 into 3 into 9 so one pair 3 we are taking one 3 outside root 9 is there that means 3 again but root 15 there is not exact root so we are keeping like this 3 into 3 into root 15 so that means 9 root 15 centimeter square is the area of the triangle for this question the perimeter of a triangular field is 450 meter its sides are in the ratio uh, 13 is to 12 is to 5 find the area of the triangle so this time the sides are given in the ratio only and the perimeter is also given so what we should write a perimeter equal to equal to 450 right now s we can calculate s means the semi perimeter only a plus b plus c by 2 so 450 by 2 that is 225 meter right now what is the given question another part the ratios are given so let us take a equal to 13 x right b equal to 12 x and c is equal to 5x right now so what is the next step a plus b plus c plus a plus b plus c equal to 450 because the perimeter is given here so i'm adding now 13x plus 12x plus 5x equal to 450 okay what is the sum now 13 plus 15 plus 10 25 plus 5 30x so 30x equal to 450 so what is x now 450 by 30 right now what is next is 0 will be get cancelled so it is equal to 50 so x value we got now what is the length of the sides because it is in ratio only so a equal to 13 into 15 right b equal to 12 into 15 and c is equal to 5 into 15 respectively the values are 195 180 and 75 so this is the original length we got now we got a s also 225 now we got all the three sides length also so heron's formula we can write by heron's formula area of the triangle equal to right root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c so what is the substitution here 225 bracket 225 minus 195 again 225 minus 180 the last one 225 minus 75 i should extend the root first because all the terms are in root only so what we have done here uh, 225 under the root of 225 into 225 minus 195 225 minus 180 225 minus 75 so what we will get in the root root of 225 into 30 into 45 into 150 right now what is the root of 225 we can write a we can write 15 only so i'll write in the root here 15 square right now 30 can be written as 3 into 10 so i'll write 3 into 10 now 45 can be written as 3 into 15 next 150 what we can write a 15 into 10 i have not written in the prime factorization way because we can we have to take the root only so as a uh, as it as far as possible we should make it in pairs only the factors now 15 square what we can write a 115 we can take out right now a pair of 3 is there now check c 3 here and here 3 so we can take out 1 3 next 
10 also like that only one more pair one pair is there for 10 so 110 I'll take out and 15 also we'll get one more pair right so this is without the root only so already 15 and 15 is there so what is the product here 225 into 30 so multiply you will get 675 0 meter square since everything is meter only 6750 meter square is the answer i repeat what is given in the question perimeter is given and the sides are in the ratio perimeter is given means a semi perimeter also we can calculate that is 225 now the sides are in the ratio only so a equal to 13x b equal to 12x c equal to 5x so we have calculated x here right after calculating x what is the next step we should find the original length of abc so abc respectively 195 180 75 now what is the next step by heron's formula a to the triangle equal to root of s into s minus a into s minus b into s minus c substitute the values make them in pairs and take out the root for this question what is the answer we are going to get 6750 meter square